Good morning, everybody. Hello. So here we are, Tuesday morning, body percussion morning. So I hope we're all feeling fit and well and have been enjoying the sunshine. So we're going to warm up. I, um, I often do this standing up, as you may or may not have noticed. I am today sitting down. So I think because what we're going to do today is we're going to use a little bit of knees and tables, caps and clips. So if you're in a classroom, then probably you will be sitting down behind the table anyway, perhaps. If you're not, or if you're in a classroom in a hall or on the floor, then perhaps when it's table, you could use the floor in front of you. Or if it's easy, you could still keep it on your knees. But we're just going to practice some different rhythms doing these things. And I'm going to teach you something about dotted rhythms today. So first of all, um, we're just going to get a beat going on our, on our claps. So quite slow, one, two, one, two, one, two, one. Just gonna feel that nice and steady. Let's do that, that's our T, T, T. Now let's do coffee, 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 just stay with me. And T, 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 T. Now let's do coffees, coffee, Now on your knees, can we do Coca-Cola, 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 T, 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 T. And again, let's do that. Coca-Cola, 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 T, 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 T. And back to coffees, coffee. Now we'll do Coca Cola. Coca Cola, Coca Cola, coffee, 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 tea, 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 tea. Okay, so there are basic rhythms that you've done quite a lot of. That's obviously our single beat note, our T sound, our one beat sound. Coffee, coffee. When we have two sounds per beat, and our Coca Cola, Coca Cola is, of course, our Coca Cola. Four sounds per beat, so they are the fast ones, always takey turny, takey turny on our knees. So, we're going to use those rhythms in a song that we're going to learn today. I'm going to teach you a little routine to a particular song. But just before we do that, I'm going to teach you about dotted rhythms. Now, some of you may know a bit about dotted rhythms. And we're going to start off with our single beat note. Basically, what a dotted rhythm does is it takes two notes, one, two sounds, two rhythms. So we're going to use it on our single beat, our T's. They're called crotchets, but they sound like T's, don't they? T, 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 T. And what we do to the first one is we make it half of itself longer. Sounds complicated, but I promise you it's not. And then we make the second one half of itself. So to show you what that looks like, and then we'll do what it sounds like, and it's much easier than what the words. So here we have our T, 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 T. Yeah, we know all about that. Here we have our one beat note with a dot on. So what that dot means is we add on half of the note value. So we know that the value of this one is one beat, don't we? We know that, we've done that lots. So of course, half of one is a half, right? So we add the two together and that becomes one and a half itself. OK, so it's not doubled. It's added on half of itself. So that's one and a half. And here we have the little half beat by itself. As we've talked about before, the, the half beats, the coffees often come in twos, don't they? Very coffee, coffee, coffee. And they have the little mark, over the little line over the top of it to connect two of them. When you've got one by itself, just a single half beat, then the little tick hangs down. Could be a bit longer, to be fair. I've made it quite short. So that's so what that sounds like is T T T T tum T tum T long short long short. Here's the beat. Here's the beat. Clap with me. T, T, and long, short, long, short, long, short, long, short. So can you hear the beat falls in here? And that's what a dotted rhythm is. 
These are basically straight beats and these are dotted beats. That's what they're called, straight dotted. So the easiest way to do that sort of mathsy bit is actually with these ones, because that's a little bit easier. We haven't got to worry about half beats. Up here, we've got four beats, haven't we? Two plus two. Down here, what's half of two? Two plus half of two is three. And there's the one. So it sounds the same as what we've just done. Straight minims, these are called the um, uh, milk sound is a minim. Straight minims, dotted rhythm minims, it's exactly the same. Okay, so that's what dotted rhythms are. We're not going to use these ones in our song. We're going to use these ones and we're going to use these ones, which are exactly the same thing, but faster. So there's our coffee, 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 coffee. Coffee, turn, 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 coffee, 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 turn, turn, turn. So the maths of that doesn't really matter too much. It's how it feels, but these are half a beat each, makes one. That is three quarters of a beat, and that's a single quarter of a beat, still makes one. That's what matters. So they take up the same value, the two of them together. But this is the long, short, long, short, straight quavers, dotted quavers. So that's quite enough talk about those. We are now going to practice those rhythms with the song. So what we're going to do is we're going to just do some um, dotted one, two, and one, two, and one, two, and one, two. So that is our dotted rhythm. Can we all join in with that? Me clap, me clap, long shot, long shot, long shot, long shot. And that is our dotted rhythm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play you a short piece of music. It's quite fast. So it's quite cool, quite fast stages. This is our beat. So we've got to go, yeah, ta -ta, ta -ta, ta -ta. And we're going to practice fitting our dotted rhythm in it. And then we're going to practice, well, we're going to practice something else after that. But I'll just put that on first. We'll have a little listen to it. And then we're just going to do our new dotted rhythm along with it. Let's do even. One, two, one, two, one, two. All right, okay, so that was going nice and fast. So that's our different rhythms. Now, tables. Can we, so far, we've done our straight rhythms. The light's a bit funny on the sheets, isn't it? We've done our straight rhythms. We've done our dotted rhythm with a single note at the end. Let's see if we can keep our dotted rhythm and just turn that single half beat into two quarter beats, yeah? So we get that we did with a clap, didn't we? This we're gonna do with a table because we need two hands to do our really fast beats. It's quite hard to do our fast clap. So we're gonna try and do um, knee, table, knee, table, knee. Oh, sorry, knee, table, clap. Knee, table, clap. Knee, table, clap. Can you join in? Knee, table, clap. Knee, table, clap. Knee, table, clap. So it's quite fast. So I'm going to put that little, little snippet of music on again. And we're going to do knee, table, clap throughout. Knee, table, clap. Ready? And knee, table, clap. Now let's go back to the straight dotted we did before. Knee, knee. All right, okay, so how do we get with that? Now I'm gonna teach you that. It's quite fun. We're not gonna do it that fast. What I thought we might do is learn it a little bit today and then have some fun trying to put that together with the track next week. So, it's a mixture of those two things. And we've also got our caterpillar, cater Coca-Cola. I also use the word caterpillar. Caterpillar, 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 caterpillar. It doesn't matter so long as it's got four sounds to the beat. Caterpillar, Coca-Cola, it's the same. I find caterpillar easier to say. So I might well say that this morning. So I'm gonna teach you as just four little lines. 
that we're going to learn this morning. So the first one goes. So it's a mixture of the two we've done. Knee, clap, knee, clap, knee, clap. Can we do that together? Off we go. Knee, clap, knee, clap, knee, clap. And then it does knee, table, clap again. Knee, table, clap. And then it goes caterpillar, tum, ti ta. Can we all do that together? Caterpillar, tum, ti ta. Caterpillar, tum, ti ta. Caterpillar tum ti ta, and that little caterpillar tum ti ta rhythm is what uh, comes at the end of most of these little phrases. And did any of you notice that we have? Oh, hello, where's your sheet? Tum ti ta at the end of that caterpillar tum ti ta. So we had a dotted, really fast one, which is our dotted coffee coffee with us, our dotted quavers. So let's put that together real slow. It goes. <gasps> Knee, clap, knee, clap, knee, table clap. Knee, table clap, caterpillar tum ti ta. And again, knee, clap, knee, clap, knee, table clap. Knee, table clap, caterpillar tum ti ta. So that's the first bit. All right, it's really fast on the track. Um, you might try just for fun putting it together. And then the second time that comes around in the, in the song, straight after the first, what we've just done, it's the same to start with, but then it has lots of caterpillars in a row. In fact, it has five. I had to write it down so I could tell you. Has five caterpillars in a row, and then it finishes off with a tum ti ta Yeah? So should we try that? Ready, steady, off we go. Caterpillar, 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 tum. There's our five caterpillars and our tum tar to finish. We try that again. Ready, steady, off we go. Caterpillar, 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 caterpillar tum tita. Right, what we're going to do is we're going to put all of that together. And that's it. That's what we're going to learn today. And it comes a couple of times down on the track. All right. One, two, off we go. Me. I'm singing the wrong pitch now. Ready, doesn't matter. Ready, steady, off we go. Me, clap, me, clap, me, table clap. Me, table clap. Caterpillar, tum, ti ta. Me, clap, me, clap, me, table clap. Now five caterpillars. Caterpillar, 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 tum, ti ta. And that is it. Let's try it again. Ready, steady, off we go. Me, clap, me, clap, me, table clap. Me, table clap. Caterpillar, tum, ti ta. Me, clap, me, clap, me, table clap. <gasps> caterpillar, 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 tum, ti ta. All right. Should we try it once just to finish off with the track? And actually, that little pattern we've just learned happens completely twice. Let's give it a go. Don't worry, full on. It's very, very fast. I can't slow the track down. This is a Hungarian dance. So it's a, a, by, a, by um, a German composer from the Romantic period of music called um, Brahms. So that's what this is. And it's a dance, so we can we're gonna dance with our hands. Let's try. We're gonna miss the first one because there's no counting, so we'll just listen to the first one. So we're gonna go listen to the knee table clap, and then we'll join in. Knee table clap, caterpillar tum ti ta, because we can't quite catch it just when I press play. Okay, off we go. Okay, you ready? And knee table clap, caterpillar tum ti ta. And it does something different, which is quite fun, which you might have a look at next week. Thank you very much. I hope your knees aren't hurting after all of that. Have a lovely day and I'll see you next week.